Oh, let's keep it going. Tonight, at the open mic, let's keep it going. All right. I, uh, when I realized I was growing older, I decided I needed to take an alternative view of the world around me because it was getting depressing. So I started taking a lot of drugs. I mean, seriously, I have taken a lot of drugs. I enjoy them. You know, some of the most outrageous, wondrous times I've had have been on drugs. But as a public servant, that doesn't mean you have to do that. Although the best time I have ever had <laughs> I'm, I'm not stuff on drugs. You know, I, I treat drugs like underwear, right? I really don't need them, but I was always taught to have a fresh set just in case. <laughs> you know, and uh, I grew up in a time when the propaganda around cannabis was like scary crazy, right? I mean, they said if you touched it, you became addicted. And if you smoked it, you went crazy and played the piano while your girlfriend murdered people. It was crazy. We didn't have the D.A.R.E. program when I was growing up, right? We just had a cop with a piece of cardboard, and on it was stapled all these drugs in these little baggies with these index card explanations, right? So as an industrious child, I went up and memorized each one. It was a checklist for my teenage years. I didn't have Pokemon, but I was going to catch them all. <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, I've been diagnosed with three different types of cancer, and I've used cannabis to treat them all. I've used RSO and extracts. I've used flour and hash. I've used tinctures and edibles. I've taken raw leaf and poured oils all over my body. It seems to have worked. There is one major side effect, though. I've been high for like 20 years. <laughs> I grow my own plants, right? I call it my garden, you know? And if you go online and try and get information about growing cannabis, you'll get all this crazy stuff, right? You, you, you'll get stuff like, oh, you gotta trim away the underbrush. You gotta shear the sides, trim the top, right? For my female cannabis plants, I prefer a full bush. <laughs> no? Okay. Well, sometimes, Sometimes late at night when I'm feeling rambunctious, a little frisky, I'll go out and I'll roll up this big fat joint and I'll sit in front of my garden and blow the smoke at the plants and just whisper, soon. I'm done. <laughs> 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 